Stopped on the side of the road here in Savannah to collect some fresh sage for the summer solstice ceremony. Hi. Just can't get beautiful scenery like this anywhere else, I think. It's such a gorgeous drive. All the way to Bidette. We're just at the beginning. Lots of outside of Savannah. Lots of marmots everywhere all over the road. Sometimes we find mountain sheep here. Last spring they were here with their babies. The coolest rock formations, and these mountains are really red, which might not show up that well in this video. Hey Linda! Orange pylons mean slow down, slow down a lot, or you're really gonna have a hard time as we did on this drive with hitting some huge dangerous holes. Note to self. This one's not as bad. We're lighting a fire in the vehicle. This better go well. Better. We're smudging in hopes of keeping the mosquitoes away and also clearing our energy. We need some more. I think it's kind of Maybe we should have did the dry. Like my feather? Just found it. Borrowed it from Ray's app. Yeah. All right, I think we might we'll have to do the dry one. Just gotta be careful I don't burn in my vehicle. Um, It's gonna flame right up. No, you don't. Uh, yeah. Yeah, okay, blow on it. Okay, okay. there we go. Hot box. Here, take this. Well. <laughs> There we go. Is it still burning? No. It's not burning anymore. Okay. <laughs> Was that enough to keep the mosquitoes away and cleanse my spirit? No. I'm not lighting that in here. It's not a good idea. Well, I'll blow it. I can't breathe. Me neither. This is good though. Good. Okay. We are on the way to the center of the universe for summer solstice. We're just waiting for Ray to get up the hill and some people from Arizona. And this is going to be super exciting. I'm excited. Don't know what to Sick, expect. Sick, but excited. Don't know what to expect, but we're super excited. Always interesting things happen here that we weren't counting on. And I think just being open to anything happening is the most important thing. Absolutely. Because you don't know what's going to happen. But a lot has changed for us in the last year since we first came up here. A ton of, you know, spiritual stuff and just changing as people, human beings, trying to live a better, healthier life. So all of this has been worth it and it's all come down to us being here for today. And yes. we're really excited to share, to share and inspire other people to get involved and to choose to live a better life. I agree. <laughs> We just got back from the center of the universe where we had a summer solstice ceremony with about a dozen other people. Um, then we sat around for about two and a half hours. In the first, it was cold, and then it was warm and windy, and it was beautiful. We've seen um, four turkey vultures that yeah. were flying in circle. 
which was beautiful. Yeah. So Lots that was of awesome. Very nice. Really awesome things and um, participated in a few different kind of ceremonial things with some other people, which was really neat. And now we are back at the cabin. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I don't know how to turn this around while I'm videotaping, so. Home sweet home. It smells like Barkerville. It's wonderful. And I noticed it's adorned with a photo of Ray on a bike. That's wonderful. Isn't it? <laughs> and now <coughs> we're going to head for a walk and go rock picking and uh, relax and go see some wildlife. Sunny. Sunny the magical unicorn. Hello, beautiful. Hello, sweetheart. You're just so special. Hi, baby. How's it going? He just wants to know if we have treats. Yeah. What's the matter? Hello, sweetie. Look, there you go. You're so you see beautiful. Now? Look at you. Hmm? Yeah, where's your horn? Hi. He's like, I know you had food. Mm -hmm. I can smell it. Give it to me. You like beautiful, horse. beautiful boy. It so good. Hanging Maybe out in front of his beautiful him. house. We just ran straight into a black bear, a nice big black bear. He was very, very surprised to see us. We're walking down this trail here. I'm gonna take a picture overviewing this water and I turned around and boom, he was right there. He, we, well, he was scared. He was a lot more scared than we were, that's for sure. It was kind of funny, actually. <sighs> Note to self, next time, bring the bear mace. So it's the next morning and we're just leaving Vedette. Just finished having a nice coffee and a talk with Ray and his guest and it's always really enlightening. They've got so many awesome things to teach and to tell us about. Um, we had a really beautiful time so hopefully if you see this video and you've been thinking about going that you give it a chance. It's a beautiful place to camp you know even with your family or by yourself and there's just lots of spiritual stuff to learn if you're open to it. And you need to remember that when you're coming out, you're going to meet some amazing people, people that you never expected you would meet, um, learn from. We had a, an amazing time at the fire yesterday, just talking about stories and experiences and what you should put out there in the world for yourself. Um, when you're feeling like everything's out to get you, how easy it is to just remember that there, it's not going to last. It'll be better. Mm keep on moving forward so life lessons and nothing is a coincidence all the people that are sitting there that you'll meet here it's all meant to be for a reason absolutely so here's a beautiful view of Vedette Lake as we are heading out of town we were just photographing the loons in the background there it's a beautiful sunny day and we are off to rock pick now a whole flock of babies baby grouse they're so adorable They're a lot faster than their mother at getting across the road. That's because she was trying to tell us, don't move. 